In this video, I'm going to show you how to apply foil to nails using Magpie Beauty's Full Foil Gel. I'm going to show you with one of my favourite foils, which is called Jerry. It's a purple, blue and green marble effect foil. So for the foils, it's always good to put a base coat underneath. So for my one, because I've got a bit of white in the background, I'm going to use Fresh as a Daisy as my base, which is a milky white gel polish. You can choose your own base colour to the foil that you're using. Once we've painted one coat over the entire nail, we're then going to cure this in the Magpie lamp for 60 seconds. Once our first coat is out of the lamp, we need to paint a second coat. So using the same colour again, which is fresh as a daisy, I'm going to paint my second coat of gel colour on and then we're going to cure again for another 60 seconds. One of my little tips for applying foil is by applying a really thin coat of velvet top coat, which is a matte top coat. The reason is because this top coat doesn't have an inhibition layer in it, which guarantees me that none of the inhibition layer will get into my full foil gel and ruin the application. I'm now going to apply a super thin coat of this velvet top coat and making sure it's all nice and smooth over the entire nail and then we're going to pop it in our magpie lamp to cure for 60 seconds. We're then going to do a really thin coat of full foil gel. We're going to make sure this coat is really nice and smooth and really nice and thin. If it's not, it will show up any little lumps in your foil when we apply it on top. And another way I found works really, really well with the full foil gel is by curing it in the magpie beauty lamp for a minute and a half. It just makes the full foil gel even more glue like. So we're going to pop this into our lamp for a minute and a half to cure before we apply that foil on top. Now to get your foil out of the pot, remove it from the centre to make it easier to put back in. So what we're going to do is we're going to pick the area on our foil that we want to use on our nail. So I've chosen this pinky purpley area in the centre. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut off that first bit to save for another time and I'm going to use that bit in the centre where it's got the white, pink and purple marble effect. I've got my silicone tool ready to use in a minute and what I'm going to do with my foil is I'm going to bend it slightly in the centre like you can see in the video just so I can guarantee the centre line is completely straight. So I'm going to place it on my tip exactly where I want it and I'm going to grab my silicone tool and I'm going to rub it through the centre of the nail to guarantee that the whole centre part of the foil is completely flat. I'm then going to use my finger to make sure it's all smooth down the sides and down the centre. I'm also going to use my silicon tool again to make sure all the sides are pressed down. Now you'll see that this is slightly easier if it was on a real nail, but I'm going to speed up this process for you so you guys can see what I'm doing. I've then got a clean nail wipe and I'm going to apply a little bit of pressure and rub it over the entire nail just to make sure that if any bits aren't stuck down, they are stuck down after doing this. Once I've finished that step, it's now ready to pull off the nail and you can see it's completely come off that foil and there's no foil missing on that nail. The next step is by using a buffer to go around all the edges to make sure we've got a nice rough edge to apply our next coat to. The next step I've found worked really well is by using a really thin coat of rubber wrap over top of my foil to make sure it properly sticks in and that I don't get any peeling on my foil. So I'm going to apply one thin coat over the entire nail and then I'm going to cure it in the Magpie lamp for 60 seconds. Before you cure it in the Magpie Beauty lamp, make sure you cap all the edges first so that they're all sealed. So you can see I'm going around the entire edge of these nails, making sure it's all sealed so that I don't get any chipping or lifting of this foil.
So our final step to finish off our look is by using a top coat. So for this I've decided to use Don't Be Tacky, but you're welcome to use Shine Bright or Like a Diamond also as one of your top coats. So I'm going to apply a nice thin coat and making sure I also cap this coat as well before I put it into the lamp for 60 seconds to cure. And here's the finished look. So this is using Jerry from the Magpie Beauty Foil Collection. Thank you so much for watching my video and I look forward to seeing your creations. If you want to see more videos like this, don't forget to subscribe on my homepage.